Hello everyone, this is Omega45, and welcome to episode 10 of my season 2 uh, Modern Minecraft Let's Play. And uh, so I've been doing a little bit off camera, as you can probably see my inventory so far. And I built one of these guys. This is an industrial electrolyzer, and this is from, my cables are freaking out, uh, this is from Greg Tech. And um, you need that to process dusts into further and further down. Um, I'm not really sure how to explain that, but yeah, that's it, that's what it's for. Um, so it's, it's, just for, and it's just another machine for processing. But I added in the recipe here, so that's all taken care of. And right now I am working on stainless steel dust, so if I remember correctly, I need iron dust. <clears throat> Excuse me. I need some iron dust, so let's grab that. Let's come over here and chuck in my macerators. And you guys will be able to see the first stainless steel I have in this world. Hopefully. Barring no disasters. Ah, 18. So how do I smelt this? I have to use an industrial blast furnace, okay. That's actually a pretty low heat, but it does take a long time. I can't do it in anything else, okay. So we're gonna need to build an industrial blast furnace. I'm gonna throw these in here for right now just to keep them on their own. Oh, uh, I've also, Add in two more storage cells, and I brought up all my stuff. So this is a uh, deep storage room, and it's just got all my kind of large amounts of items in it. So there's all my cobblestone, and I have storage buses just sitting on the uh, sitting on the back of them. So that's how that works. Well, other than that, nothing really has changed since episodes. So let's see. You'll have a blast, haha. -ha. Get your first steal. Alright. Induction furnaces. Hmm. Copper and ferrous. these up as well. These used to have something really cool called additive emacerating and if you put two in at the same time you would get um, what you wanted. Copper nickel dust. That's way more than I'll need, but oh well. Um, I'm guessing I can just do this in a normal furnace. Also cook up. I need a wire mill as well, I believe. So let's just check again. Yeah. And this needs quite a bit of stuff. Uh, do I have the conveyor module in here? No, I don't. Okay. Let's take clear. Oops, back. I'm gonna do this recipe. Iron, don't want that. Are 
battery, battery, control circuits, done. Do I have batteries? No, I don't. I'm trying to get all the uh, the plates to be the same because Greg Tech and IC2 actually do use different plates. So encode, and then I need this. Encode, and then I need this. Encode. People are always curious about why I can fill one of these up so fast, and you just kind of saw why. So that is just the conveyor module. I just need some brass plates. So let's see, brass is made by how? Zinc, pulverized copper. Ugh, I don't want to get the zinc. I hate zinc. Brass dust, dirty bottles, zinc dust, sulfurite. Oh. That's tin. So apparently, if you throw tin ore in, we get some. I think you can find the stuff in the nether, actually. Let's see. I use it with. Pretty much any hour or or ten. Cool. So let's see. Uh, I don't have access to beryllium cells yet. They're made from, oh, this is persulfate. How do they make persulfate? Chemical reactors, sodium certified compressed air cell. Yeah, whatever, that's fine. Uh, I'll just do water. And on the other side. Alright, so let's just, I'm just going to run this down to hook up to the uh, input to the tank. Should probably just do this. This doesn't use water like Terribly fast, but it does use it. So mercury, take that out. Ooh, I have a bunch of cells. All right, so this is going to start processing up, and I am going to get zinc dust out of it, as well as crushed tin ore. So I'm going to let that go for a while. I'll have some zinc, and I'll be right back. All right, so I have my brass ingots now. Let's. I think this need to be plates, right? Uh, wire. No. Yes, of course they need to be plates. Everything needs to be plates. Let's pound these down and then let's. I think everything else I need. Let's go do this. Yeah, I'm gonna need another advanced alloy, so I need. 
Nope, it's metal ingot. Iron, bronze, tin. It's just making, oh, it's making me, um, Greg Tech versions of it. I don't want that. So. Why is it the Greg Tech version? I'm gonna need more bronze. Uh, presser. But for right now, that should be enough. I'll probably make a stack or two of these in a bit. Alright, so you should have enough now. Advanced machine block. Yes. Okay. Alright, let's see if this works. Yes. Alright. Sweet. Uh, I need my coils. right now. Come on, there we go. Ugh, this is gonna take a while. Okay, I'll be right back again. Alright, so I have my coils. So let's see what I can do. Clear. Also gonna need some casings. I'd like some reinforced ones. Pull my mic up closer. There, hopefully you can hear me better now. All right. Reactor casing. Lots of casings. All right. So this is just steel, advanced circuits, and a advanced machine block in the middle. How much steel do I have? 
I should have enough. Okay. So that's. Two sacks, so I can always make more. This stuff is pretty useful. All right, so let's let those cook up, and I will be back. I'm also gonna probably do some more uh, mixed metal alloys and and uh, get ready for the um, advanced plates. So I'll be right back. Okie dokie. So. Um, I need 34 of these, I believe. So this is going to craft these guys up. Yeah, it's slowly eating up my iron. I don't know how long it's going to take. You can see it's like it runs a while. Hmm, cool. Hmm, that's really should be on. I thought this was going faster, but oh. Um, casings. So I'm gonna put I'm gonna put him over here. All right, so I also wanna put lava in it helps the heat I'll just grab my blast rings blast begin oh I didn't tell it how to make induction furnaces okay Sweet, it'll take an automatic one. Um, I want this to take the automatic one. There. Automatic e furnace. Okay. And to make you, it is that in code, and then for you, oops. Oh, I'm just going to do it all cobblestone, please. Yeah. That's annoying. Okay. So I should now know how to make them. And it does. Sweet. So cables and blast furnace and I'm also going to need my um, stainless steel dust which is new. Okay. Oh, 
awesome. So 2200. So let's just dig a quick hole under here. Drop down. Sweet. So I now have a blast furnace up and running from Greg Tech. These supposedly take forever. Use. Yeah, 200 in 75 seconds. That's like five minutes. It's a long time. How much can a blast furnace take? Uh, 128. So we attempted to put a MFSU underneath it, and but I have to really, I would have really have to step it down if I want to do that. What about um, CESU? I think it's called. That's pretty easy to make, but only holds 300k. MFE. I I would only have to step this one down by one. But I need to make the um, Enderium dust. Which is annoying, but it's not too hard. Um, all right, I'm I'll I'll craft that off camera, and then uh, I'll be right back. All right, guys. So I have done a just crazy amount of stuff. Um, so I. Increase this by one size, and I have four pages of stuff. And I also put in the um, molecular transformer pattern for da -da -da -da, solar panels. So I actually already have one. Craft it up. Okay. Um, and then this, I can actually need some glowstone. Need eight. So let's excuse me. Let's go put this down. I'll just put it downstairs. Or I could probably put it like here. Did that work? Let's see if this works. Did it eat my glowstone? Dang it, I put it in the wrong place again. Yeah, it's eating my glowstone. Wonderful. Let's go like that. Let's go like that. And that works. Okay, sweet. So let's grab I need two more glowstone. That looks actually really cool. Fast. Is this guy draining? That's empty. That's empty. Um, it's draining at full power. Okay. That's really fast. Let's see if I can actually keep up with that. Activate. Activate. Oh yeah, <laughs> just a little bit more, just a hair more. That's pretty sweet. So I'm making scenario parts. So I need two more glowstone.
let's see. S O L A R. Sola. So this is going to be redstone, diamonds, and lapis. So I have some redstone. I should have a couple diamonds, you know, just a few. Why did I say lapis? Okie doke. I think that's everything. Okay. I'm also going to need some of these, the iridium glass. So I'm going to need what? 8 times 3, 24. Sixteen circuits. Boom. And then what else do I need? I don't think I need much else. Oh, um, advanced alloy. We can put this together. I need an assembling machine though. So, uh, it doesn't look too hard. Do I need a sticky piston? No, okay. So, I'm going to do steel plates. Gonna do circuits. Like that. And that should be enough. Okay. Let's hit and code. Right there. So I should have four more of these. Hmm. Basic machine casing and an assembling machine. It's already done, okay. So let's grab these. One thing I uh, actually I do miss about old Minecraft is actually crafting things and setting out the recipes and stuff in chests like that and um you know, just like old types of stuff. If you ever watched Nebris' uh, Feed the Beast Let's Play, you know what I'm talking about. Because that was just so cool. He had the best base, uh, one of the best bases I've ever seen in my life. And these things take forever, so I'll be back. Alright, so I have eight solar panels. Let's oh wait, I'll grab my these dudes. And let's get to work. So Unfortunate. If 
I could click in the right places, it would have gone there. But, you know, I can't. Alright, so let's go across. These go there. These go here. Uh, these go up there, I believe. And that goes there. Haha! -ha! Eight advanced solar panels. So, these are for is just supplementing uh, my power. So, solar. No, wrong thing. UNIV. Universal for cables. Because I kind of want to put these up here. Look at power underneath glass, yes they will, okay. So all these are doing is just supplementing my power. They're not being like super fantastic or anything like that. I'll see one, one, two, three, four. Go like bam, 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 bam. Do four on the other side as well. One, two, three. Oh, that's annoying. They're different lengths. So this doesn't produce a crazy amount of stuff, but it will slow down how fast these are getting pulled out of, I think, hopefully. And they're not outputting. Why are you not outputting? Do that. Ugh. All right, I'll figure this out and I'll be back. All right, so I think I figured this out. I spent some time in my test world, and I'm gonna build a uh, MFE real quick. So, do I actually have this recipe? And I do. Haha. -ha. I doubt it will work though. Yeah, I need some energy crystals. Some gold plates. And made some energerium dust. So that's what Ruby. This one, I need this stuff. Okay, yeah, let's chuck that in there. That was in there. That's gonna take a while. Wonderful. <clears throat> I really need to overclock that thing. Would probably help out a lot. Let's see where is the MFE recipe. I need to. I need just to go through and like fix all the plates. Cause like half of them are right, half of them are wrong. That's really annoying. All right, let's see. How are you doing? Made like that code. Perfect. So M F E craft. So I should just need the plates now, yeah. Hopefully this is enough. So let's try this out.
All right, working so far. How do I switch the faces on this? So this is obviously going pretty slow since it's at night and this is only producing one EU a tick. During the day it will produce eight. So I'm probably gonna make, I wanna make 16, or not 16, eight more of those. Um, but that'll have to wait for another episode. This is all just going to go into storage for right now. I'm gonna grab, I'm gonna make another energy cube and then that's gonna be used for creating UU matter. And I want to, until I'm into fusion, I'm gonna try and do all solar power for UU matter. So it is really just awesome like that. So let's see. I'll, I'll craft the energy cube off of, off camera because you guys have seen that like a million times. Um, <clears throat> but this will just be used for everything uh, other than the energy cube. So I'll make or, or do I want to switch those two around? Because we need a lot of solar panels then. Yeah, I'll figure it out. But um, that's all I have for today, guys. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.